It does a lot of damage to a lot of people. For Peter Salm, the pain of loss is still fresh. His brother Rodney died in June after he and his girlfriend were caught in a road rage incident between two other drivers in Eagle Mountain. Obviously what happened to us was devastating, but uh, if we can prevent that from happening to other people, that'd be wonderful. That's why he hopes Utah lawmakers will do something. Do you see a road rage bill? this next session. Yes, absolutely. Representative Paul Cutler is trying to build support from other legislators on Capitol Hill. Our intent is to go after those uh, very serious cases where somebody is trying to assault someone else with a motor vehicle, where they brandish a weapon, they threaten and intimidate people because of an incident on a roadway. Utah Highway Patrol says road rage is getting worse every year, but there's no law on the books defining it. Cutler wants to change that, enhance penalties, and educate drivers about it. But one lawmaker questioned whether laws like this are effective. They look good on paper, but in practice, I just don't see that they're actually deterring anything. In fact, I see things getting worse. Cutler says there's still work to do, while the Psalm family hopes all of it will lead to action. I'd encourage them to move forward.